Hi friends, it's Stacy at Florida Life Real Estate Agency and Mobile Home Sales. I'd like to show you around this home today, so let's get to it. Fair warning in advance, this will be a long video tour. The home is currently occupied by seasonal tenants and uh, they don't wish to be disturbed uh, frequently. So uh, it's my hope that this will be a very thorough tour uh, to give you a really good idea of what the property is and what makes it so special. It's located at 6523 New Jersey Street in Trailer Estates. Uh, I'll talk a little bit more about the community uh, at the end of the video, but it is a Sarasota Bayfront community with marina and uh, all the community amenities that you might expect. So you can see here that um, there is a carport, covered porch, and a screened in lanai uh, with vinyl windows. We'll take a look at that a little bit closer. Uh, but there is parking under the carport for one car, but there is additional room um, for one uh, car after that. Uh, this would be the porch that would walk into the kitchen area. It is a Trex deck with vinyl uh, picket railings. There's a section of vinyl fence there on the left that is mainly just for privacy. And then the remainder of the home uh, is surrounded by a four foot picket fence um, that's enclosed for a pet since this is a pet friendly uh, home in the community. You even have your own pet door there into the lanai. So we'll take a quick walk around, uh, let you see uh, this oversized lot. It is secure, as I said, for a pet. So if you are someone who has been in long search of a community that would be pet friendly, uh, this section does allow it. You can see on this uh, side of the home, it's very well planted, uh, giving um, full shade on the southern exposure of the house. Uh, there's also a nice little uh, brick paver patio, which we'll take a look at. And the owner has uh, used, again, this privacy fence panel at the patio uh, to, to enclose it and give you some privacy. If you're a pet owner and have been interested in manufactured housing, you know what a rarity it is to find such a large uh, lot that's completely fenced in and pets totally uh, are allowed here. Uh, there may be some restrictions as to the number of uh, pets and or size of dogs that would need to be verified with the office. But again, such a lovely yard uh, and safe for uh, your pet to play in. There's a little butterfly garden uh, that you would see some nice blooms on in the spring and summer. And the rear of the property uh, abuts to a park-owned parcel that does not have any plans to be built out uh, on. So the, the view from the back of the home is this wide open field. And as I said, they, they do say they are not planning to do any building back there, but it is owned by the community. Thank you. 
What you're seeing here is the corner of a custom built uh, workshop area and we will take a closer look at that a little bit later on. Okay, we'll go ahead and head into the home. Uh, we're going to enter through the lanai. As I mentioned, there is uh, it's a screen lanai with vinyl window sliders. If you noticed in any of these images so far, uh, this manufactured house does sit uh, in the opposite direction that most people are used to. Typically they enter from the front and move lengthwise and this home is set uh, uh, widthwise on the property. So you do enter from the long side of the building and uh, enter into the living room uh, and you can see the long stretch into the uh, kitchen and breakfast nook area. You'll see that there's plenty of storage in this kitchen, uh, including disposal, dishwasher, uh, range, microwave, hood, and a laundry closet. We'll take a look at all of those. There's your view from the kitchen sink. And here's the cooking side of the kitchen with the range and refrigerator. It does have a bottom load freezer with ice maker. And the laundry closet is located uh, at the very end of the kitchen in the breakfast nook area. Washer and dryer do stay and also provides uh, plenty of storage, pantry storage above the washer and dryer. The owners have this area set up as a little seating area um, that would go off into the front porch there. You could also easily put a small dinette uh, type table there. And do notice um, that there, uh, those two windows there are frosted, so that increases your privacy um, from the neighbors. This is the primary uh, bedroom, has a walk-in closet, ensuite bathroom with walk-in shower. And uh, you'll see that this uh, is the rear side of the home and does look out into that open field area.
plenty of storage in this bathroom. This would be your guest uh, bathroom off the hall. It does have a shower tub enclosure. some additional storage here in the hallway. And this would be the second bedroom or guest room. Uh, this uh, is the other end of the home that would look out into the private uh, patio area, which I will show you out the window. This home is not being offered furnished, uh, but the owner has said that they are willing to have the discussion. Again, this gives you a little bit of a better idea of the size of the lanai. I'll give you a better idea now of some of the technical and layout uh, of this home. This is the solar system. Uh, more information can be gleaned from the manufacturer and or the owner, but it is a hands-free system and you will not have an electric bill. 
Uh, I'll be showing you here the solar panels on the roof of the home. And this is the layout. So take a pause if you'd like to see how this property is set up. This is the custom built uh, workshop area. It is fully insulated and does have its own AC system. There's two doors, one double door and one single door. So you could essentially put a golf cart in here if that's what you chose. This is just a little view uh, on the street itself, just giving you a perspective of where the home sits and the surrounding area. Trailer Estates is jam-packed with amenities. It has its own post office, woodworking shop, swimming pool, shuffleboard, bocce ball, kayaking, horseshoes, um, a view of Sarasota Bay, and a full marina. Thanks again for checking out this Florida Life listing. If you have any questions about this home or others that might be available, feel free to give me a call or text at 941-809-1318. Again, it's 941-809-1318. I'm always happy to set up a personalized search for you to find just the right home for you. And if you're thinking about listing your home, Florida Life can help you with all your real estate needs, including manufactured housing in land lease parks. I'd love to hear from you. Once again, our phone number is 941-809-1318. You can also find us on the web at floridaliferealestateagency.com or floridalifemobilehomesales.com. No matter how you find us, I'll be happy that you did. Have a great day, and I hope to talk to you soon. Bye for now.